Hi guys, it's Chelsea and welcome back to my channel. So I know it's been some time since I last vlogged and I'm really sorry for being away again. Um, but let me give you guys a quick life update. Um, I think my last video was around July. And at that time, I was so busy with my evals. So yeah, your girl is finally done with her evals. And thankfully, I passed all of the seven review courses. So I am about to graduate. Oh my god. Yes, it's been like more than a month since that time and for August I've just been chilling like I've just been catching up with myself and with my family and friends so yeah that's what I've been up to recently I've been watching some Netflix shows currently I'm watching I started watching Gilmore Girls and Once Upon a Small Town oh last week I watched NCT 127 live in Manila which was something that I'm really, really happy about. Like, you guys know, if you've been watching my videos, you would know that they're my old group. So, I'm really happy to see them live. And I finally saw Mark Lee live. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, so much for that. If you guys want more updates or like in-depth stories, you guys can always ask. Or I can make a separate video about it. Whatever you want. But yeah, for now, I'm here to answer some of your questions about internship. Because a lot of you guys have been DMing me, a lot of you guys have been commenting on my videos, and I know it's been some time since I last made a video, so I want my comeback video to be about that. Without further ado, let's get on to it. I'm gonna go through your comments and I'm going to be answering them. Why am I like so nervous to vlog? Like I used to do this all the time. Okay, so I forgot to mention that I was an intern at PwC Philippines, Isla Lipana and Co. Okay, so during the period of our internship, um, I really wasn't able to say kung saan ako nag intern but I did say that it was one of the big four, which is true. So, ayun. Um, I just didn't mention it before for confidentiality reasons, but now that I'm about to graduate, yun. I was an intern at PwC Philippines and an assurance intern to be exact. And they have an internship program called Game Changers Camp and I was part of that. So, ayun, just a little background then. Um, my friend told me about it and he sent me a link. So, final out ko lang yun and then uh, very responsive naman sila. You guys can find the link also on PwC's page. I know that they're already like recruiting for this year's batch. So ayun, I just filled it out and then I had an I had to take an exam the next day and binibigay din naman agad yung results ng exam. So ayun, I immediately found out about it. Actually, and dami kong inaplayan before. No, not naman super dami, but like um I was really trying out my luck on LinkedIn and other like job posting sites, pero at that time, yung ibang mga companies and firms hinahanap nila is for like on-site interns, but as per our university's policy, dapat ano lang kami, um, remote setup. So, ayun. Um, good thing na PwC offered um, parang work from home setup or like remote setup. So, yun. So, yun. Without further ado, ito na talaga. We're gonna answer some questions na. First question, hello po, ilang months po kayo nag-internship? Um, I wouldn't really measure it in months kasi I was an intern from October 25 to February 11. So, that was such a long time. Pero, in reality, 400 hours lang yung nirender namin because yun lang yung required. But, kaya nagtagal ng ganun because um, parang almost all of December, parang one week lang kami nagkaroon ng um, pasok nun dahil, ayun ko, busy yung mga tao sa PWC. So, di nila din kami maasikaso. And, ayun. Dahil holiday season din siya. Okay, next question. May ginagawa po ba kayo everyday? Like, super busy ba kayo? Thank you po. Hindi kami super busy everyday, pero everyday may session. Like, from 8am to 5pm. Kasi nasa Google Calendar naman yun. And lahat per day talagang may invites kami for Google Meet. So, makikita mo na sa calendar mo anong days yung half day lang or anong days yung um, whole day. But, hindi everyday is a busy day. If you guys know what I mean. Like, we're not doing so much every day pero every day my session next is hi can i ask what are the inclusions given by pwc for the interns like if there's any may mga laptops po bang provided and other accessories thank you ate so wala actually wala talaga kaming natanggap na kahit anong like um some companies kasi may mga pa laptop sila for the interns but you have to like return it after your internship period yung iba naman may mga allowances for the interns but for us wala like not at all 
Yeah. Um, next question, may I know if you have any idea if they accept new batch of applicants by November? Thank you, by the way, new subscriber here. So, hello. Um, I don't think they're accepting by November kasi yun nga, last year, we started around October and I was applying by the end of September. So, ayun. I think your first batch started around June. Tapos, second batch na kasi kami. So, kaya, October kami nag-start. So po, just wanna ask if you are asked to choose if hybrid or full remote po ba ang internship nyo. Just like what I said earlier, full remote yung internship namin. And actually, if I were to choose, I would choose um, on-site internship para mas feel. And I feel like I would definitely learn more from that. You have to follow the guidelines, so fully remote lang yung internship namin. Next is, hi, accounting related po ba yung exam or puro subject? Puro subjective questions lang, hehe. So, I'm assuming she's talking about like the exam for like the application. But no, it wasn't accounting related at all. It wasn't um, challenging at all. Like, medyo nag-review ako actually before the exam. Pero to be honest, yung questions niya is more like um, grammar correction. Mga personal questions lang yung iba. So, you really don't have to worry about those. If I were you, just chill. Next, hi, I'm in coming fourth year in PUP accounting then. I'd like to ask if paano ang pag -pros if paano ang process sa pag fill up ng MOA. Thanks. By the way, I really enjoy your vlogs. Thank you so much for watching my videos. So, ayun, for the MOA or the memorandum of agreement, since madami kami nag-intern sa PWC, like hindi na namin siya inasikaso. Um school na nag-asikaso for us. They um communicated with the PWC na rin para isahang Pirma na lang, and then they just sent it. Uh, they just sent us a notarized copy of the memorandum of agreement. Yun. Next question. Ano ang mga need na requirements for internship? So for our internship, um, I actually made um different folders on my laptop and on Google Drive. I backed it up on Google Drive para organize lahat. But basically, um. I think I can speak naman for most companies na naghanap ng interns. Ang hinihingi nila lagi is resume or CV. So, I made mine using Canva. Um, endorsement letter sometimes or recommendation letter. Memorandum of agreement that should be notarized. Um, copy of grade since hindi pa naman tayo graduate. And ID and birth certificate. Yun. Next question is, how was internship? So, I would have to say that it was a fun experience. Pero talagang, when I was like in second year or in third year, I was really looking forward to having an on-site internship. Na parang na-imagine kayo sarili ko naka-OOTT sa office and then commuting to office. I know it's very stressful. But like, it was one of like the, the things that I always see on movies and series that I always imagine myself doing. Pero hindi nga siya nangyari. But nevertheless, it's, it's a very fulfilling experience to get to meet other people. Um, my fellow interns from other universities, also other people from PUP na parang first time ko lang din nakilala. And also our seniors in the firm. And we got to do activities as a group like case studies. And I definitely learned a lot more. Nung una, like medyo lahat kami clueless talaga sa, oh my gosh, like parang how do we apply the concepts that we have learned dito sa mga pinapagawa sa atin. But, yun. Thankfully, we got through it. Um, hello po. About sa internship, kailangan po ba na nakahanap na ng company kahit summer term pa lang or hintayin na pagpasok ng school year? So, not necessarily. Like what I said earlier, I started applying around early September. Pero yung internship namin or like our semester started October pa. So, ayun. Um, I suggest you make a LinkedIn profile Cause nung time na lang, nung time na yon, dun lang din ako nag-start gumawa ng LinkedIn and until now I'm like browsing LinkedIn every day for um, opportunities and also connecting with other people that I can possibly like you know maybe meet in the future career-wise. So ayon, hindi naman kailangan na maangang maghanap cause yung iba kasi immediate hiring so hindi ka naman pwedeng mag-start na maaga as per the university's guidelines. But yeah. So, next question, ano po ba ang dapat nakalagay sa CV na ipapasa for internship? So, CV stands for Curriculum Vitae. It's kind of like a resume. Um, I don't, I can't really tell the difference between the two. Pero, ayun nga, like what I mentioned, um, I made my CV on Canva. Also, my resume, I made it on Canva. It's pretty much the same. I just, like, um, alter the contents from time to time. So, yung CV, it must have your 
definitely your information like your name your address your contact number and your email also make sure that you check your email all the time guys a two by two photo like your id your work experience if you have any your um, previous internship experience if you have any um your education details like any significant awards that you receive you don't really need to put like yung mga malilit na awards yung mga best in ganyan ganyan syempre mga significant lang uh, seminars that you attended that are, of course are uh, relevant to your what you're applying for so i think that would be it for our video for today thank you so much for watching and for being here after how many months comment down below what videos you guys want me to do next because i do have a lot of time on my hands right now yeah let me guys know if you have any more questions i'd be happy to answer it don't forget to spread love and light love you guys so much i'll see you in my next video bye it's really nice seeing you again